sport body needs exercise in order to achieve results in competitions. Sport bodies are devoted, diligent, and sympathetic. It is well prepared and ready to perform. There is also a sense of belonging and national pride in both. But it's also about the results. Each sport body is specific, needs specific training. First, you get into the unit arm. It can be embarrassing. Your legs are naked. On your feet, you have poor vision. Enter the gym and start running in circles. Then start working out with your arms. Music is irrelevant. Ballet or the exercises of strength can be a part of training. Your upper arms and shoulders are the most important in order to be able to operate the apparatus. It's all about flexibility of the joints. You should be technically trained with joystick elastic flexible. You should be able to put your legs behind your neck, touch your butt with your head, or fold yourself into a knot. There are no limits. It's a body of extreme possibilities. It doesn't get tired, never. It doesn't ask the question, it executes. It's not selfish, it is available. Ellen's sport body was in motion for 14 years. Half human, half robotic. The routine consists of a series of segmented elements. It is never a continuity, there is no surprise. The difficulty of the elements varies. Each element should be practiced approximately 100 times. It's like a map, a video game. Ellen started to train at the age of 4 in Yugoslavia and finished by the age of 17 in Croatia. She was a part of the national representation of Yugoslavia of the team of rhythmical gymnastics. Ellen became a national anthem. It was the year of political struggle. Ellen was also becoming a teenager in this period her body was changing. Ellen carried out the national identity. Her results were the matter of the public interest. Two weeks after the Yugoslavian championship, there was a clear cut. The country doesn't exist anymore. 1990, Ellen became the multiple champion of the Independent Republic of Croatia. Ellen also was the first female athlete that entered the Croatian Encyclopedia of Sport. Ellen was supposed to represent the Independent Republic of Croatia on the Olympic Games in 96 Atlanta but couldn't be trained by the Russian trainer due to the political circumstances, so she resigned. The Olympic board was struck by her decision.